Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When a customer overpays you or gives you a down payment or prepayment, you record the amount received in the Receive Payments window. Doing this creates a credit for the customer or customer job specified. Later on, after you have created an invoice for the specific customer or customer job, you can return to the Receive Payments window to apply the customer's existing credit. To apply an existing customer credit to an outstanding invoice in the Receive Payments window, select the name of the customer or customer job who has the outstanding invoices and the credit that you want to apply. Select the invoice against which you want to apply the credit from the listing shown. You should not attempt to place a checkmark in front of the invoice as that indicates the invoice is being paid. Instead, click anywhere else within the invoice line other than the checkmark column to select the desired invoice against which you want to apply the customer's credit. Then click the Discounts and Credits button in the main tab of the ribbon at the top of the window to open the Discount and Credits window. Select the Credits tab if necessary to view any available customer credits. To apply the entire amount shown, click the checkmark column next to the credit in the Available Credits section to mark it with a checkmark. The amount shown will be displayed in the Amount to Use column. To apply a partial credit amount, change the amount of credit applied by simply changing the amount shown in the Amount to Use column if needed. After entering the amount of credit to apply, click the Done button to apply the credit amount to the selected invoice and return to the Receive Payments window. The credit amount applied will appear in the Credits column at the bottom of the window. You can then finish receiving customer payment as needed within the Receive Payments window. When finished, click either the Save and Close or Save and New buttons to save the transaction and either close the window or clear the window, leaving it open for additional entries. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.